Alrighty, we're done. We're parked. We're down to the nitty gritty hours wide. Madam was itching to get stopped and get out of the truck. She gotta do the peepees and the poo poos and all that other crap, I think. That wasn't meant as a pun. Anyways, yeah, what a day. <laughs> For the first load, things did not go quite well. I do have to say. But that's the problem when you have uh, um, a new contract. Things don't always go as planned. But talk about major poo poo. Yeah, I get there and uh, yeah, the load's not ready. Even though it's supposed to be, it's not ready. So we sat five and a half hours waiting for it. But yes, I'm getting paid for it. <sighs> but still, it kind of put a screw into my day for as far as driving goes. Because, I mean, I should have been able to make it back to Brampton, drop it, and, you know, start heading back this way. Not that I would have got far, probably wouldn't have gone as far as maybe Kitchener to the service plaza there, or, you know, uh, the uh, Flying J there in the air. So that would have been all right. That was the plan, anyway. But did not happen. So here we are in Comber at the Etho. We were going to go to the pilot, but it didn't really need to and this one she was in the tremble stage it was like dude you better pull this freaking truck over or I'm going to the bathroom because I had to go she says Yippers. you're supposed to be on the grass dinky do yeah you're supposed to be on the grass oh, on the sidewalk <laughs> no we're just gonna walk up and down here a little bit get some exercise for Miss Madam. Come on you, get away from the sewer. All right, yeah, and then it'll be dinner time. I haven't decided. Is it gonna be a Timmy's dinner or am I gonna just throw a soup on or something? Who knows? We'll All see. right, I have no idea what this electrical vehicle parking. What the heck? When the heck did this become a big thing that they've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, parking spot charging stations wow that's just strange that they have electrical vehicle parking I seen it from the distance and I didn't what the hell is it I gotta go check this out that's just freaking weird nothing on this side I guess you just take the cord and you plug her in that's just strange. Huh. I guess... There's a high demand for it. Because, you know, they're so busy here with it. Yeah, there's like tons of vehicles that are electric and parked here. Hmm. Uh, strange. Alrighty, so can someone in the comment section explain that one to me? Tesla vehicle, electric vehicle parking. That was just weird I mean I know we have our hybrid vehicles out there you know when they're on the highway they're gas when they run in below a certain speed they run electric and people get home they plug them in but do we really need like are there just pure electric vehicles out there that just run electric someone from this area tell me is there a test project maybe going on out here that I haven't heard about not that I would hear about it not that even if I saw the headline, I would pay attention. But yeah, that's first time I've ever seen that. Anyone else seen that? No, it's first, first for everything, I guess. We got an empty garbage here, poo head. You want to look the fork? Oh, lick the fork. Yeah, yo, lick the fork. Cause you're hungry. He says, I'm hungry, Dad. Feed me, Seymour. Anyone know where that's from? Huh? Huh? Come on. Come on. 
Feed me, Seymour. Little House of Horrors, I think it was. Or something like that. Anyways, yes, I broke down. I went and got Timmy's. Okay, I got the Timmy's. I'm thinking, oh yeah, I'm going to have... I'm going to have the... Uh, ah, fuck this table is stiff. i got to figure out why. Um, chili. I'm going to have chili with a bun. That's going to hit the spot. I get in there, no chili. And then I see up on their board, they got... Um, Cream of uh, broccoli, and that stuff is usually really good. So, what the hell did my. Uh, hey, don't attack me. Freaking thing attacked me. Uh, cream of broccoli. Yeah, they're out of cream of broccoli. It's like Fregman. And then the other soups they had were like. <laughs> didn't want them. So, I said, fine, give me ham and Swiss. Oh, what are you going to do? Tell me that the pig ran away and there's no more ham. But luckily there was ham still. So, yeah. That's what we're having is ham and Swiss sandwich for dinner. I wanted to keep it somewhat light because, I mean, it's freaking 9 o'clock. So, what can you do?